Okay, notice that we have this algebraic expression and our goal is to simplify this expression. We have three y over four minus two y over five. Notice that the denominators are not the same, but we wanna make them the same. And so we have defined the LCM of these two numbers, four and five. We list the multiples of four. The multiples of four are four, eight, 12, 16, 20, and 24, and the list goes on. The multiples of five are five, 10, 15, 20, 25, and the list goes on. This is actually supposed to be a comma here. So we put a comma. So the multiples of five are five, 10, 15, 20, 25, and the list goes on. That means that the lowest common multiple of four and five is 20. So we have 20 in both of them. So the lowest common multiple of four and five is definitely 20. Next, we come here and we ask ourselves, okay, what times four gives me 20? And the answer is definitely five. So four times five is 20. Whatever we do to the bottom, we must do to the top. So we have three Y times five. Then we come here and we ask ourselves, what number times five gives me 20? And the answer is definitely four. So four, five times four is 20. Whatever we do to the bottom, we must do to the top. So we have two Y times four. Next, we see four times five and four times five is 20. And we have three Y times five and three Y times five is definitely 15 Y. And we have five times four. Five times four is definitely 20. And two Y times four is definitely eight Y. Notice that the denominators are the same, so we can subtract these two fractions, but we have to keep the same denominator. And so we have 20 at the bottom. We have 15y, 15y, we subtract, we're subtracting the numerator, so we have 15y minus 8y, 15y minus 8y. And when we subtract, we have the following. We have 15y minus 8y, and that gives us 7y. So we have 7y all over 20. And this is our final answer. 7y over 20 is the answer for this question.